think dogs get freaked out by people picking up their shit? Oh, I swear I had a shit then. <laughs> I definitely had a shit just then, definitely. I felt it coming out. <laughs> something not right here. <laughs> Must have run off. <laughs> That's why dogs keep sniffing each other's asses to try and find out where it's gone. I love all animals. Do you like animals, generally? Yeah. Good, I love animals. You're a bit of a twat if you don't. There's that many different kinds. I mean, there's something for everyone. And we've got Noah to thank for all the animals. He saved all the animals, right? Without Noah, there'll be no animals at all, which would be shit. Especially if you go into the zoo. Uh, 14 quid to watch a tyre swinging about. Oh, I can have a go. Brilliant. That would change it for me. The amount of times I've been to the zoo, they're outside the monkey cage thinking, they're having a better time than I'm having. <laughs> How come I've paid 14 quid to get in here and I can't even go on the adventure playground? Because <laughs> I think the monkeys, they've, they've sussed it, haven't they? The thing about monkeys, they knew when to stop, evolutionary-wise, didn't they? They thought, right, we can use our thumbs, that'll do. <laughs> we went, no, no, we want to keep on and get shoes and clothes and television and hate each other. Monkeys have got it sussed. I love the monkey life. I would love to be a monkey. But who doesn't want to spend the afternoon sitting in a tree, scratching your knackers and throwing your shit at whoever walks by? It'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? Not in my street, apparently. Uh, I don't know why I pay me council tax at all. I find the whole Noah thing quite hard to believe. The fact he's got all these animals he's never heard of before. What people don't realise, back in Bible times, there's only about seven or eight different animals had been invented. And they all lived in a big house around the corner from Noah. So it was really easy to get them involved. <laughs> but what happened, they were at sea for about two and a half years. And all the animals started getting it on <laughs> in between the species. And that's where your new animals come from. So for example, like a wolf fucked a chicken and that's an eagle come out of there. <laughs> oh, I've thought about this. Uh, got a lot of time on me hands. <laughs> and then like a giraffe fucked a chicken. Ostrich, in it? Ostrich there. Uh, suddenly it all makes sense. Now I know what you're thinking. The chicken's getting a bit of a hard time of it. <laughs> Seems like the chicken's just been passed round. <laughs> what people don't realise, chickens are probably the randiest animal on the entire planet, right? In fact, pretty much every animal that you know of today is a result of a randy chicken running round the ark and sticking its cock somewhere where it shouldn't be. <laughs> and that's why everything tastes like chicken. So I'm single. Yes, I know, it's a shock. Uh, people say it's all right to be single. That's rubbish. Nobody's ever come up to me and went, oh, I'll tell you what, Seymour, you make a lovely single. I could see you being by yourself for the rest of your life. But I hate it, so I said to me mate, my mate says, you've got to get on the social network. You've got to get on the computer. Who's got a computer? Who's got a computer? Yeah, yeah, they're quite popular. All right, lots of people have them, right? I don't have one. My mate's got, he says, come round mine, we'll get you on the Facebook. Who's on the Facebook? Yeah. You should be ashamed of yourselves. It's not real. Did you know it's not real? It freaked me out. I went round my mate's house. I got on the Facebook. I've been on there two minutes. All of a sudden, a little message popped up. Jeremy has thrown a snowball at you. <laughs> has he? <laughs> Who's Jeremy? not a very good shot, is he? <laughs> so I've ignored that. I've let it go. Three minutes later, another message. Maria has sent you a machine gun. 
she wants you to join her mafia family. I thought, how cool is that? Five minutes and the mafia's getting in touch. And then I figured out it's not real. The mafia aren't even on the internet. Because I've looked. There's no mafia.com. All them things that you think you're doing, you're not. All them hugs that you think you're sending, you're not. All them snowballs that you're throwing, all them mafia weapons you're sending, all them stupid little farms that you think you and your mates are working on, you're not. It's not real. It's all exactly the same thing. It's all this. <laughs> So anyway, my mate said, you've got to get the Facebook, right? So I thought, all right, I'll go for it. So we're, we're, we're in back around my house, right? But like I said, I don't have a computer. So what I've done, at the front of my house, I've got like a bay window there. I just stand there all day. And down this side of the window, I've put up a list of all my hobbies, interests, <laughs> my favourite film, Deliverance. And, uh, <laughs> and down this side of the window, I've put loads of photographs of my mates being dicks. I just stand there all day waiting for people to walk past and try and entice them in to be friends with me. <laughs> I haven't had much interest. Uh, a couple of my mates have been round and taken their photographs down. Ha ha ha. Had a bit of interest from the police. But like I said to them, you can't wear your clothes all the time, can you? <laughs> That's dirty. It's not my fault I live across from a school. <laughs> oh, is that the time? I hate people who do that. Oh, is that the time? Of course it's the time you're looking at your watch. You don't mean is that the time. You mean you're bored of my company and you want us to go. Oh, is that the time you might as well just go, oh, piss off. <laughs> Let's go,